Hello everyone, I'm VK here. Thank you for joining me in this video session. If you are one among those who are wondering how Service S Plus is licensed, then this video is for you. Service S Plus is licensed based on its edition and the count of technicians and notes. The application is available in three different editions, Standard, Professional and Enterprise. Standard edition is licensed based on the technician's count. It offers you incident, SLA and knowledge-based management with customizable dashboards and reports. Professional edition is licensed based on technicians and notes count. This edition offers you IT and non-IT asset inventory management on top of standard edition features. Enterprise edition is licensed based on the technicians and notes count. Using Enterprise Edition, one could manage incident, service requests, problem and change processes. It also offers you knowledge-based management, CMDB and project modules. Who are technicians in Service S Plus? Technicians work on tickets and resolve the end-user or customer queries. They could deal with problem change modules, manage assets and administrate the tool if required. What are nodes? The assets that could be scanned using WMI, SSH, Telnet and SNMP protocols are called nodes. For instance, workstations, servers, router switches, access points and network printers fall into this category. But no license is required to manage non-IT or non-IP based assets like monitors, keyboards and scanners. Who are requesters in Services Plus? Requested is anyone who creates requests through self-service portal or by email and they do not require any license in Services Plus. Thank you for watching this video. Subscribe to our channel for more Services Plus related videos. Stay tuned.